we read it and everyone just thought it was wonderful except Marshall. And he, the difference was he had come down there knowing that she couldn't have children. And, and so Marshall said very nicely, uh, so this play is essentially him, him coming down there and beating her up until she admits that she can't have children, which he knows all, all along. Why doesn't he just say, uh, I know you can't have children and I don't want children and I don't see any problem with this. Uh, he made it very vivid that, you know, what's the fun in watching him beat her up when he knows already that she can't. Of course, without him knowing, then it becomes this huge coincidence that uh, he doesn't want children and she can't have children. And that is called a plot and it just sticks out a mile in, in this play. Uh, and we both saw that, that that was going to happen and said, oh well, try to live with it, try to smooth it over as much as possible. But there's almost an audible click when she says, I can't have children. That is simultaneously satisfying and very disappointing because you feel, oh, it's all just been a design, you know. It's all just been, you know, I just pulled the wool over my eyes. Just been a plan.